Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, this week I have made the decision to do a little bit of a change, a switch. I don't know what you call it, but I had the realization this week that the last three weeks I've been really struggling to actually figure out what to do and I tried to do a tutorial and it didn't work. And I always just end up doing like a character on a white background and to be honest I feel like there's so many people on YouTube, artists on YouTube that do this, like, like they draw really cool characters in a white background and that's mostly what they do and not to say that anything wrong with it but there's just so many of them that you don't really need me to do it as well and yeah there's either people who do characters on the white background or very pretty girls uh, with flowers or posing and illustration um, but there is very few that actually do comics or something more story based that a, a picture that tells a story and I feel like for me to actually manage to make this YouTube channel on something, I need to do something that I know I will be really excited about every week that I can do more of and uh, just keep doing it. So what I have decided to do is every week I am going to tell a story. And it doesn't matter what kind of, if I have made the characters before, if I have them design the characters again, or new, um, and if there's old characters, maybe as well. Um, but I will tell a story. That's the whole point of this. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Um, so maybe might be an illustration, or might be kind of a comic kind of thing. Like this one is a main image, and then I was like, ah, I kind of want to draw. Two other small ones, just because I want to draw a cute cat and a scared girl. Yeah. Um, so yeah, every week I will do... Well, I say every week, we'll, we'll see how it goes. I would do still want to try and do some tutorials and stuff like that. But I have to figure out a way to do it properly. I don't want to give you guys a half-assed um, tutorial. Um, but yeah, I hope, really hope that you guys will enjoy this and see what comes out of it and how many I can do. Um, so, to the story. So this week I picked up two characters from a school assignment that I had over a year ago, I think, uh, where we had to create our own IP, which is basically just a plot described in one sentence and draw characters for it and like a scene illustration kind of thing it's mostly for games so mostly you just have to see what's there what's the design um and i'm really interested in like pokemon and i really love the comic called monster allergy so kind of mixed those two and made this series creation something called nettle and the hush hush and so my IP or one sentence plot was A young girl embarks on a quest with her beast companion to lift her strange curse, the ability to see the invisible monsters existing among us. So yeah, so this this um, girl called Metal, she um, from a very young age she started to see these weird monsters, hallucinations, creatures that she was super scared of and they started to tease her and maybe bully her and it was just really scary and she tried to get help from pa her parents and adults around her but they can't see them so they just thought she was crazy so in the end she figured that these creatures were hush hush like it was a secret um, if she said anything about it, then um, she will be seen as crazy, and she didn't want that. So this Nettle is very shy, so she just locks herself in and doesn't want to talk to anyone about it, and she just tries to ignore it, and that's the best she can do. So where this scene, that illustration that you see, 
um, is when she first see cat, which is what she will name the cat <laughs> later. She's very um, creative <laughs> when it comes to name, just cat. And uh, the cat, or he, or she, I'm not sure what he is. Um, maybe he. Well, she sees the cat and she's like super scared because it's basically a freaky cat that's staring at her and like rummaging through the garbage and she gets scared of course and she's like oh shit no I don't want to see this cat and then the cat is just staring at her because he is really interested to like finally see someone that can actually see him and he's just like fascinated so I will not tell you what happens next because that will be in the next video because I think I want to do the next one because I'm really excited about that. Um, so yeah, this I just really wanted to draw them when they were younger. I will show some previous concepts if you really want to see that. Um, I kind of still like these, but I, they were a bit rushed because school was hectic and stressful. And I can clearly see that I've rushed, <laughs> rushed it. But it still shows what it is. Um, characters needs to be a little bit redesigned. Um, but for this uh, illustration I did a young design of Nettle and her companion cat. Um, so I really hope you guys like this little illustration kind of comic kind of thing um, that I'm trying to get going. I'm not sure like what kind of series I will do uh, next week. I do have this, I mentioned this in, the, in my last video that I have this project that's kind of occupying my mind and that is um, I really want to do a children's book and I have the story and I have the thumbnails for it and I thought that it would be really fun to share the process like everything with you guys. I will show the character designs, the uh, interior designs, creature designs, because it's going to be creatures in this, because I love creatures, so... <laughs> Just put everything I love in one book, that's what I'm going to do. Um, the reason I'm doing this is because I really want to work as a children's books illustrator. Um, because I just... I just have all of these memories from when I was younger, and I just really want to be a part of children's, like... Like imagination and young life and I just feel like they could be more children's books with even more fantasy elements like I'm thinking like picture books like what is it like four to seven years old kind of range maybe three I'm not sure I have to figure that out um so yeah I think I will start to share it that with you and I'm trying to like get through it um, so expect that the next videos next coming weeks will be mostly the children's book but if you guys really want to see more of what happens to Nettle and Cat please tell me and I will definitely do another piece on that because I probably will need a break uh, from um, <laughs> children's books and plants there's gonna be a lot of plants in that um, and also, I'm also very open to suggestions, any critiques, um, and any if you want to talk about anything, if you want to know how I do anything. As you saw in this video, uh, it's far back now that I use SketchUp to just get like a rough perspective, so I know what to draw. Um, and I also use um, images when I do colors to blur that out to get a quick color schemes that I can use for the rest of the image and I can show that like slower in the other video if you guys want that or character design or character expression I don't know I've know that you guys want to see how I do like color line arts and maybe poses and characters there's a lot of things I can show you how to do uh, but there's also a lot of other tutorials online on YouTube that are really good um, but yeah I think that's about it guys. I'm coming to an end on the screen here and I'm just adding some effects and some words just to like make it a little bit comic-like. And just uh, you guys before I forget to tell you, um, I think I will start uploading videos on Saturday instead of Friday 
um, because that will work better with my schedule. Uh, that means I can do voiceovers on Friday evening as well um, if I did make it on Thursday. Uh, it just seems like the last few weeks I've been stressing about getting everything up on Thursday, so I think I'll give myself one more evening after work to be ready and then you guys will get it on Saturday morning. So it'll be like breakfast morning kind of thing. I know I said I was coming to the end of the video, but I have like two minutes left, one minute left. So i um, trying to figure out what to say. Uh, how are you guys doing? <laughs> what are you guys up to? Do you have um, any personal projects that you really want to get going on? Um, please tell me about it in the comment section. And I just really want to chat with you guys and I will always respond to any comments. Um, I always go through my comments and reply. So please tell me about what you're going to do this weekend, if you're going to do anything very interesting or fun or just be lazy like I will be. And yeah, I just hope you guys have a very good weekend. I'm trying to look at the <laughs> time to see if I have more time. Um, it's a bit long video and I'm sorry, uh, about 12 minutes, but that's what comes out of six hours of work. Um, I can't really shorten it anymore because that will just be annoying. Um, but yeah, I think that's about it guys. I really, really hope you guys enjoy this video. If you like uh, the video, please like it. Um, if you want to see more, please subscribe. You don't have to. But if you like, you can. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next week. Bye-bye.